Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Surviving Mars, Inventive India. Now, uh, we've pretty much got the game won here. Um, uh, I'm thinking I'll probably play it out until the domes can be opened. Uh, until all of the uh, uh, sectors are scanned and all and the domes are open. Uh, we're up to uh, uh, 12 and a quarter percent atmosphere, uh, 10 and a half percent temperature, and we've got uh, some uh, uh, water here. Uh, so now I'm going to um, let, uh, we'll capture some more ice uh, here. Uh, so we'll send the expedition. Uh, we have um, yeah, production of everything is through the roof. Uh, yeah, basically, uh, we're uh, ahead on water, uh, we're ahead on air, uh, we're ahead on power, uh, and we're researching the uh, uh, large-scale excavation so that's the uh, infinite concrete wonder so there's not much more to do here uh, we've got the mo hole we've got the space elevator uh, uh, you know like the like really uh, all the only thing else we can do with the mo hole is uh, you know dump 800 uh, machine parts into expanding it one more time and quite frankly, uh, that seems kind of pointless. And uh, yeah, uh, so basically, uh, I'm going to uh, run through um, run through this uh, for a bit here, and uh, uh, see how it goes. Uh, now. I'm pondering doing a uh, particularly difficult uh, challenge uh, next time around. Uh, I, I stumbled on a, uh, a video series uh, where a, a guy did a uh, maximum difficulty uh, challenge uh, on, uh, on surviving Mars. Uh, that uh, basically means that you pick the hardest sponsor, the uh, hardest... Um, uh, mystery, the uh, uh, the hardest uh, settings and the uh, game rules, um, and uh, you know the hardest location on the map, which is uh, forty one north, uh, eleventy one west, and that's uh, uh, and that gives you a base difficulty of. Uh, uh, you know that gives you a difficulty of a thousand and seventy five percent when you're setting up the game uh, done with an added um, added uh, a twist of no rivals uh, that uh, that really makes the uh, the game quite hard uh, and the rules are basically all disasters on maximum uh, last arc so you can only bring one uh, one uh, you know passenger rocket and uh, a few other things randomized text uh, you know like, like a few things and uh, I guess the the hard sponsor is paradox interactive and uh, the futurist uh, um, commander profile and that gets you uh, you know basically once the rules are selected you've got a base difficulty of 890 percent and then you get the added difficulty of a mountainous uh, region on the colony region and that uh, that basically uh, uh, it, it can basically put paid to your whole mission before you get started anyway the uh, uh, the challenge uh, I took a shot at it myself and uh, like the guy doing the series he had three 
uh, attempts that failed. Now I think a couple of them failed because he had some mods in there. But uh, I took a couple of stabs at it myself. And uh, the first first one, I uh, I was doing okay and then a bit of inattention and I ran out of a critical resource and uh, you know th there just wasn't any way to recover uh, I ended up with the population spiral going down uh, the second time through again it was inattention I ran out of a critical resource and then I couldn't repair my infrastructure and again a colony collapse spiral uh, the uh, third time around, uh, I bailed early on it because I messed up the early going. But uh, the fourth time through attempting it, I actually uh, uh, made some uh, progress. And uh, I may have made just enough progress that uh, I survived a, uh, I may have survived a major blunder. Uh, which was I wasn't paying attention to food production and uh, my population outstripped uh, the food production and then I ended up with a major uh, starvation event where uh, basically a little more than half of my colonists starved uh, and that is not good uh, on the other hand uh, I did manage to get a uh, get food production up and uh, since I had the uh, uh, hanging gardens uh, already uh, I was able to keep the birth rate up uh, possibly enough to keep to recover the population now the mystery that uh, the guy doing the series picked was the Metatron one uh, which is particularly hard because you actually have to deal with an invasion. And that's uh, not exactly easy. Uh, the one time I did have that on a random roll, it ended me. Uh, I could not survive it. Uh, anyway, uh, the, uh, uh, the mystery I chose, which is equal difficulty, is the uh, uh, the one with the war. Um, basically, World War Three or something like that breaks out on Earth. Um, that one is flagged as difficult as well. Uh, but I don't think it's near as hard as Metatron. And it does come with refugee rockets. So... Uh, the second refugee rocket hasn't arrived yet in my current offline playthrough, and, uh, and when it does, it should uh, it should uh, give my uh, colony the boost it needs to recover. Uh, the the third there's a third mystery that also is max difficulty, and that's the wildfire one, which is a pandemic back on Earth that actually gets into your colony as well. Uh, and that one is uh, really, really annoying as well. Uh, now, if you know which mystery you're going to get, you can prepare for it. And, uh, you know, that makes it a little bit easier. Uh, so the, uh, the Metatron one, uh, it's just um, difficult. It really is, is what it is. Uh, the uh, the war one uh, isn't too bad. You can muddle through it. Uh, the wildfire one is actually a lot harder than it than it looks because uh, your colony gets hit by the uh, the pandemic as well, and it can collapse your colony, uh, and that's uh, definitely an issue. Uh, uh, it, it, a colony that's on the brink will just be wiped out by it. Uh, whereas uh, if your colony's doing well, well, you still end up with a bit of a problem because uh, you have to, uh, th to succeed on that mystery, you have to, uh, you know, grow the, uh, 
the wildfire cure. Uh, that's the, the name of the pandemic in there. And that requires growing cure tatoes. Yeah, great name that. Which basically erase your uh, soil quality in your uh, farms. So, yeah, it's pretty nasty. And there's a lot. You have to export a, quite a lot of them to uh, complete the uh, mystery. Uh, I managed it uh, the first time I, I got that mystery. But, uh, yeah, it's... Uh, rather uh, rather tough if your colony is already strained okay so we're uh, 81 is that 81 81 percent I think to the uh, ice asteroids let's just take a look in here and see where we're at um, mega satellites right that's what I'm going for now, actually, on my uh, 1075 uh, game, I ended up with a breakthrough that I'd never seen before, which was uh, which was the uh, the one where excess power turns into science or, or research points, and that was uh, kind of interesting. Okay, so we've got a big pile of uh, of that. What do we have here for uh, dome services? Uh, okay, so we're producing way more electronics than we need. Um, uh, way more polymers than we need. Uh, uh, maybe I'll, I'll go for the workshops. Um, okay, let's uh, take a look here. Uh, creative disposition is 10,000 and uh, creative realities it, that's going to be 6300 you know what I'm going to grab these okay yeah and I'm going to outsource okay now, something else I can do is uh, I can soak up a bunch of... How many renegades do I have? Almost none. Uh, what I can do is, uh, under here, uh, I can soak up a bunch of... Uh, a bunch of the... Uh, uh, population by uh, putting up a few uh, research labs okay we've completed the uh, ice asteroids yeah I'm gonna put up a bunch of uh, research labs and uh, yeah I need some living space as well no, 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 no. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to do this. Apartments. How many does that hold? Twelve. Yeah. Smart home. Four. Uh, right. Well, I'll uh, dump in... Uh, let's uh, pick a different style here. And I'll dump in a stack of these. Like that. Lend the rocket. Yep. Okay. Uh, right. Okay, so uh, I will uh, open all shifts on these. That will soak up a lot of uh, colonists that are sitting around doing nothing. 
Uh, yep. Uh, what have we got here? What's that? A casino complex and a university that's full. I'm going to make another one of those, too. Uh, right. And put it there. Okay, so that will uh, continue with our uh, ridiculous uh, birth rate here. Right. Yeah, we've got uh, plenty of resources to do all of that, so there's no reason not to. Yeah, anyway, uh, I'm pondering uh, for the next series uh, actually doing something like the uh, uh, the 1075 uh, difficulty playthrough. And uh, that, um, that should be uh, quite uh, entertaining. Apologies for the background noise, if it came through. Uh, anyway, um, yeah, so we've got... Uh, uh, where is it here? Uh, okay, we've got the uh, university. Uh, we'll get all shifts going. Yep. Uh, now, right, okay. Uh, so now we've got 3.2k per saw uh, with the uh, uh, with the research labs we just popped up. Oh wait, this one has the science boost, doesn't it? Uh, yeah, yeah. So that's uh, that's definitely uh, um, right. Um, Okay, so we've got uh, co massive collaboration loss. <laughs> uh, right. Um, but really, the point there is to soak up the... Uh, okay, creative realities. Now, uh, that gives us a uh, dome service uh, VR workshop. That is... Uh, 30 workers total. Okay. Yeah, well, uh, I'm going to drop a couple of uh, th these in. I think there's an achievement for having a stack of uh, workshops. Now, um, where's the space elevator? You stop exporting. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay, now. Uh, yeah, we're probably okay there. Uh, right. Now, uh, these maintenance is only, uh, okay, well, we'll open all shifts, all, uh, slots, and we'll do that. So we can just soak up our uh, excess uh, uh, population. Okay, we've got here the final one. Open, open. Now we've got 160 uh, vacant slots. And we've got... Uh, 
well, a massive population coming, so... Yeah, we should be okay there. Uh, right. Now, this is a... Uh, ginormous dome. Uh, right. Now let's, uh, let's go back in here. Uh, planetary projects. Uh, Okay, so we've got those. Uh, what have we got here? Uh, research amplification. No. Uh, what have we got here? Cloning. Right. Right. Okay. No. Well, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll grab that. Okay. Uh, that is... Yeah, okay. That's fine. I don't remember what I had in there, but uh, that will do. And we've got a cold wave. Uh, yeah. Okay, so what I want to do is, uh, do, do I have any of the subsurface heaters? No. Um, what I, what I should do is chuck up a whole bunch more power. That's what I should do. Uh, right, okay, so, uh, sterlings, oh yeah, I've got plenty, I can build a field of sterlings, uh, right, well, first thing I'm going to do is, uh, uh, it's in here, I'll, uh, chuck up a triboelectric scrubber, where am I going to stick this, I'll stick it over here. Okay, and then I will very quickly chuck up a sterling generator beside it. Uh, right. Need that so it doesn't freeze. Okay. What the... Where did it hit. Uh, it doesn't show anything uh, totally damaged there. Okay. Right. Okay. Uh, so we have this which will max the service area on it. Okay. And that's going to come up uh, right away. Good. And now I will... Uh, how far out? To there. Okay. Now, I will uh, grab power. Sterling... Ah, oh, man. Okay. Well, I can down-tempo that while I futz with this. Uh, two, three, four, five. Okay. Six, seven. Okay. Uh, six, seven. Now... Uh, power cable you can go there okay uh, 
Those need to... Uh, what's this require? Polymers. Okay. What if I do that? And oh, we get a whole bunch wants to go into upgrades as well. Okay, now what's this do? Additional power when open. Okay. Uh, uh, additional text. No. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so what does that uh, give us when it uh, finally uh, activates? Thirty power. Oh well, we we finally we went positive. Okay, so that's good. Okay, when this uh, row of uh, sterlings activates, or finishes, uh, we'll be able to... Uh, well, the whole grid will uh, activate properly. Okay, one more. Oh look, a sanity breakdown. Um, uh <laughs> cute uh okay okay uh right where was i messing about here. Okay, so that's uh, okay. So these can open and upgrade and uh, now uh, the cold wave is done. Uh, okay. Right. Well, that seems to be uh, progressing. Um, oh yeah, we've got uh, huge, huge... Um, okay, we're down to 2.5k there. Is that because these buildings are... Yeah. Uh, they're uh, a little bit understaffed. Um, how's the uh, university doing? We only need nine scientists. <laughs> right. Uh, okay. Well, we have 970 power. Oh, look. Um, one, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Another row of uh, stuff to uh, be uh, scanned. Okay. So far, so good. Now, uh, I want to take a boo up here. Is there anything out here? Uh, right. Let's um, uh, see if there's any text that they want to trade. Uh, yeah, okay. And uh, contact, exchange... Okay, close. Right. Now, uh, this here, um, it, uh, research. Uh, 
That requires the dome. Okay. Well, let's um, let's take uh, some of these out. Okay. Yep. Now we'll uh, grab the uh, hawking thing. Okay, now we'll see, uh, I'll take a look at what this does. That probably reduces uh, collaboration losses. Uh, right. I'll put a second one of them in there. Uh, right. Okay, so let's uh, take a look here. Oh yeah, that... Uh... Yeah. Um... It's just more efficient. Um... Right. Uh, so we're up to 465 uh, machine parts. Um... Now, what do these things do? Uh, right. Uh, I wonder what the uh, milestone... Okay, let's just take a look. No, we're not, not in there. Four domes with spires. Do we have any fun spires to uh, chuck up here? Could put an arcology. Uh, network node, Martian network. Okay. Uh, right, Martian network. Behavioral shaping. Uh, Martian Network. Chuck that one in there. Eh, we might as well just outsource some more. Right. What do we get for the, uh, the Spire? 8,000 research. Hmm. Oh, we can capture ice asteroids again. Uh, send expedition. Go. That'll get us up to 20% water when it's done. Or a quarter of the way on temperature. Almost a third of the way here. Um, I think we need a couple more carbonate processors. How's this doing? Yeah. Oh, we can get uh, toxic rains now. Okay. Okay. Uh, where are we? Uh, dust storm in seven hours. Well, okay, we are uh, producing 31 polymers. Uh, okay, so what I should do, uh, where's the electronics uh, production? That's machine parts. That's, uh, that's electronics. Okay, 
Well, in that case, uh, we'll go here. Uh, electronics factory. Bang. Put that in there. Yep. We'll just produce more of those since uh, we need to suck up rare metals. So, well, I could export them, of course. And uh, concrete. Um, yeah, we're uh, running a little bit short on concrete. Uh, we're producing seven. Uh huh. Okay, so I definitely need to get that uh, excavator thing. Uh, so what I'll do is uh, large scale excavation. Move that back to the top. Okay, so that uh, should pop up in the next uh, bit there. Uh, Spire, well, what's an arcology want? 48 concrete. Let's, uh, let's just do that. Uh... Okay, and uh, that takes 32. Yeah, we'll uh, drop a second arcology up there. Uh, right. Uh, and I think we can just... Uh, waste rock processor. Yep. Uh, I can make uh, a couple of those. Uh, that should uh, generally sort things out. Of course, I could always exploit a concrete deposit. Um, but that doesn't seem like uh, the sporting thing to do at this point. Okay. That's uh, come up. Uh, okay. That should get uh, more production for concrete online. Suck up more uh, waste rock. Yeah, that's going to... Okay, finish. Uh, there we go. 4.4 is another 8. Right. Uh, definitely need that, uh, that deep... Uh, thing here uh right should should get that in no time here now let's see uh research per soul uh yeah way less collaboration loss okay uh right 93 Uh, this here is waiting on concrete, right, 95. Where am I going to stick the thing? Well, obviously over by my uh, waste rock piles here. Yeah, that seems reasonable. A uh, whole bunch of stuff not working, but uh, we'll get that sorted out.
Okay. Um, right. Uh, it's going to be a uh, wonder. A wonder. The excavator. Okay. Drop it here. Uh, what does it take? 80 concrete. <laughs> right. Go up. Okay. Now, uh, I'm going to need to connect a power cable. Maybe not. Where does the power need to connect? Over here. Okay, well, we'll do that. Uh, right. Okay, so those are producing 4.4 each. Uh, we're down to, yeah, our population's growing pretty solidly. Well... Um, production. Well, we'll do do a couple more of those. Right, I can take them down again after the uh, the thing is uh, operational. Um, right. The key is to get the concrete production up. Uh, well, it actually is. Uh, but get it up enough that we can catch up on the constructions. Those, yeah, those just want... Okay, do I have... No. You. Uh, okay. Okay, well, we'll um, vacuum up a bunch of uh, electronics there to, uh, to fill in the uh, drone capacity. Now, uh, we're uh, drawing down waste rock at a uh, substantial rate here. Uh, right. Let's uh, upgrade those as well. Uh, right. Uh, okay, so how is the... Missed a uh, sector for uh, scanning there. Okay. Uh, right. So... How's this uh, this doing here? Uh, concrete. Uh, we're into uh, uh, 52 of 128 in construction sites. Uh, right. Oh, we got toxic rain in a soul. Uh, 
Yeah. Well, uh... Okay, so what have we got here? Uh, okay. Oh, right. Yay. All factories closed, huh? Right, uh, how's this doing? Uh, 61, 62, right. Uh, right, okay, so that should be uh, uh, checking stuff out pretty quick. that, you know, I suppose that doesn't need to be max priority now. Oh, we had the uh, Arcology come online there. Uh, Martian Born Strength, okay. Uh, right. And this here is uh, getting there. Uh, right. You know what? Let's uh, bump that one up just to get it done. There's the Martian network. There we go. There's the arcology going up. Uh, right. And then that will be coming online real soon now. Uh, we'll add some more drones there. And here. Yeah, that's okay. Uh, right. Uh, that needs uh, stacks and stacks of concrete. Uh, right, okay. And there's the toxic rain. Uh, let's just uh, take a boo in here. Um, uh, right. Well, we'll take that, and we'll take that, okay. And just for fun, we'll take some outsourcing, okay. Uh, so that's uh, mega satellites, right, okay. Uh, so I'm going to uh, run this one up until the excavator comes online. Uh, now we're, uh, uh, where are we at here? Uh, 36, we're almost halfway there. Uh, how's this doing? Okay, that's got everything it needs. Okay. The uh, ice asteroids are going to be uh, collected uh, real soon now as well. Okay, it's uh, it's making progress. This here. Okay, we'll get the, uh, oh, uh, we can capture more ice asteroids, uh, send expedition, 
go. There we go. Uh, how fast are we? Yeah. <clears throat> GHG factories are adding a quarter percent per sol. Uh, that's up to 53. I suppose I should land the rocket. Except, yeah, I can. Okay. Uh, right. Uh, no. What was it? Oh, yeah, I was going to uh, go in here. Uh, and I was going to queue up a couple of additional uh, shuttle hubs. Uh, one here. And I guess... Uh, yeah, I'll stick one over here. right here. Okay. Make that one the priority, though. Now, do I have... Yeah, I've got the maximum shuttles everywhere. Uh, right. Okay, and you are at 66. Okay, so we're just churning through the waste rock. Now we're consuming like 360. Uh, right. Okay, I, I think I'll be upgrading the mole hole as well. Now what's this? Uh, we're consuming 11. Uh, oh yeah, we're, we're producing enough of them. Okay. Uh, that's running full out. Yeah. Okay, ten more. Okay. Okay. That goes up. What we've got here? Uh, two homeless. Um, right. Okay, that's constructing. That's constructing. Good. Okay. You can max out. Now. Uh, we're going to end up uh, sucking back a whole bunch of uh, power for this thing. Uh, yeah. And there we go. Uh, I can get rid of uh, uh, the extra waste rock processors here. Okay. And I think it might be smart to chuck another one of these things out here. And I think we're just at 500 colonists.
Right. Uh, that. That's good. That's definitely good. Okay, that's coming up. Uh, right. Okay, well, uh, stock up on drones there. Yeah, that should be that should be good. Um, right. Well, anyway, uh, we shouldn't be uh, low on concrete anymore. So, uh, with that, uh, I'm going to I'm going to end it here. And next week, uh, there will definitely be another episode. Uh, I'm not sure how many more. Um, there will be at least one more, maybe two. Uh, this is pretty clear that uh, the game's won. Uh, we'll be able to terraform the planet. So uh, I'm going to see if I can, how quickly I can get through to opening the domes, which I think is about 93% atmosphere and 50% temperature. And once I get to that point, I'll probably just, um, you know, chuck in the towel because it won't be interesting at that point. It's just uh, um, basically uh, getting vegetation up to 100%, uh, which is going to be seed, uh, uh, seed, you know, uh, seed vegetation uh, missions, uh, get water up, capture ice asteroids, uh, get, keep get the temperature up more. Uh, which is just build things that make heat and get the atmosphere up, which is uh, these things. So, uh, really, uh, that's that's probably all there is to it. Uh, anyway, uh, you know, stay healthy. Uh, don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. And uh, see you back uh, next week. <laughs>